hot temperatures, we saw that humidity get at very high points today, as well as the warm temperatures hovering near the triple digits. 22 News reporter Heath Cobb spoke to some medical professionals on how you can stay safe during the heat. Heath? Well, Jack, I can tell you, I'm not a doctor, as you know, but I can tell you this, even right now in the shade, the cis heat is oppressive. And if you do not take the proper precautions, it is dangerous out there. So in this intense heat and humidity throughout the area, people are trying everything they can to stay cool. And in this weather, both heat exhaustion so and heat stroke are at greater risk. I spoke to Dr. Robert Baldor with Bay State Franklin about how people could stay safe from heat exhaustion. Really, the, the best advice is limit your stress, strenuous activities, stay well hydrated, take frequent cooling breaks, avoid the hot sun, and uh, really uh, uh, be careful with your activity. Both heat stroke and heat exhaustion are caused by your body's inability to cool itself. And if you overwork your body when it's hot outdoors or even indoors, your body may have difficulty producing enough sweat to keep you cool. Now, a spokesperson for Bay State Medical Center did tell me today that they have seen an influx in more people going into their emergency rooms because of this heat the past few days. For now, working for you live in Springfield, I'm Heath Kalb, 22 News.